Hello, welcome to another episode of SDS. As you guys can see by the title, we're going to be grading or giving a grade to the big seven Premier League clubs. Newcastle are now involved in that big seven. Obviously, there are a lot more than seven teams in the Premier League. So if you guys want us to cover all 20 teams in the Premier League, let us know in the comments below. I, I just have a feeling this will take a bit long. Uh, so let us know in the comments exactly what team you support and where you'd grade them in the system. And hopefully after the window, we will grade the rest of them. Uh, as you guys see next to me, we have a familiar face. It's been Back. a while. For some of you, Back. it might be a new face if you've been only yeah. been supporting for the last two weeks. Who are you? What are you doing here? My name's Star, Star Player, SP Shooter, whatever you want to call me. <laughs> yeah. I'm back, baby. You got expert. <laughs> yeah, League oh, expert. Come on, man. The fact that you have to introduce yourself is mad because you've mm. you got the most appearances in SDS history. OG. Oh, right. but it's, it's, been, it's, been, it's been a minute. Uh, opposite me, Lias is back. Keeps Making spot. This a regular occurrence now. Hey, yeah. man. Mm. Hey, man. Mm. Hey, man. We back, <laughs> man. Mm. First time was so nice. Second time was also so nice. Hey, Third time times. was nice. <laughs> Fourth time times was nice. nice. Fifth time was <laughs> nice. <laughs> Sixth time was nice. Hey, man. Hey, man. And next to him, Lee, yeah, man. You know, we back in the building, back baby. From, straight from Seriously. ducking the Man United you know, smoke. No, we had to mm. set it his way. <laughs> That's a tactic now. Lee, Lee man. Lee man ducked the, the smoke when yeah, Arsenal man. beat United, but now he yeah. wanted to come back today. Yeah, you know me, man. Tactical. I don't I mean, like that. Like every time we lose, <laughs> you're lucky. I gotta explain it. You're lucky. Lias wasn't familiar with our game. COVID. Yeah. No. Now, yeah. now I'm more than familiar with it. Yeah. Game. More you than you've been familiar with our game. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You now weren't familiar. I'm, I'm, I'm extremely familiar. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's get into this. How did Lando? He had it, Lando. Yeah, he did. He did. Oh, no, nah, no. I hate the fact he came out unscathed and he just dancing about. Yeah, yeah, enjoy, <laughs> enjoy that day. <laughs> left. left. Where were you? Where were you from the podcast? I was in the same place. As my brother stars. <laughs> <Same Hey. thing. laughs> Whatever he was at, I was there I was too. There. <laughs> Whatever Are we he gonna was say? up to, I was up there. It was well. a fun night. Yeah. Right. <laughs> 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 all right, all right. Let's get into this tier list. So the way we're going to do it is you've got a tier list on the screen. You guys can see it right now. Mm. It'll pop in and out. Okay, we don't want to distract you guys too much. You could just listen to the conversation. If you're listening to the audio, we'll, we'll explain everything to you. Don't worry. Um... And we're going to mention each team and then we're going to discuss their ins and outs briefly, maybe their marquee signing or their big exits or whatever. And we're going to give them a grade. The grades we have are A star, A, B, C, D, and F. Right after D is a straight F. Mm. Um, and F Fair is enough. obviously a stinker. It's, it's I mean, a, F for yeah. Fazel, F for, F for <laughs> Fail. F, F. You know, nothing good starts with F. <laughs> you know? Who is he? Nothing good starts with F. So F is, is, the, is the worst you can get. Mm. We'll talk about every single team. Um, obviously, we've got Arsenal, two Arsenal fans, two United fans. So it'll be interesting yeah. to see Good how balance. we both think about our team's uh, transfer windows. Mm -hmm. But let's just start right now. Obviously, also we want you guys to get involved in the comments below. Let us know if you want. If you have a lot of time, do it with us. You know, leave a comment below and give all your teams with their rankings and grading and all that stuff. If you have all the time, if you don't, just tell me where you would grade your own team. So write down your team name, team you support, and your team's transfer window. Lastly, as well, uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, hit subscribe. We're literally. A Rizzler paper away from 200,000 subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> like Rory likes to say. That's what Rory says. Well, a Rizzler paper away from 200,000 subscribers. So please hit subscribe. There's we need that. We you need that. You can see that 200k. Exactly. There. You can see the stats right now. There's some people are watching right now that aren't even subscribed. So hit subscribe. I can't uh, believe that many people are not watching, you know. That's a lot of people. Yeah, and not watching and not sub. Yeah. And we have a lot of audio listeners as well. So if you are listening, hit the follow button. Well, Give well, us a little rating. We're trying, to get, we're trying to get some sponsors on the show this year. So that would be nice. Anyways, let's get into this. Too long of an intro. Chelsea's the first team we start off with mm -hmm. Todd Bowley's bank account is booming booming <laughs> it is Bro. Bowley's booming bank account <laughs> yeah you did that twice you did that <laughs> <laughs> I forgot where it's from yeah. I <laughs> alliteration what I know where it's from it was that day we was in the living room I remember darkest had a strop the dog is had a stroke. Well, what did he do? What did he say? The river, I mean, bring this up to the podcast. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this guy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. All right, oh. Chelsea, right? I'm going to read the ins and outs so far. And then um, you can discuss about it, right? So they're ins, okay? I've been uh, uh, Fafana, mm -hmm. uh, Benoit Badia-Shil, Andre Santos, Jao Felix on loan, Mikhailo Mudrik, which is obviously the big one which we're going to discuss, uh, Noni Madueke, and Malo Gusto. But then... Out, they've loaned Malo Gusto back out um, to Leon, and they loaned out someone called Cesar Casadei. 
Yeah, and obviously sign, Chelsea know. have a potential for Enzo yeah. Fernandez and Moses Caicedo. So this transfer in the Chelsea and Ziyech Bro. potentially going and Ziyech to potentially apparently it might be going to PSG. So why are we grading this? We're starting off Chelsea because they're the big it boys. It has mm-hmm. to be an A star. This yeah. is the craziest A-star January star transfer online. window I've ever seen in my life. But this is supposed to be the period club, for, for every club, club well, ever. Yeah. This is supposed to be the period of the season, guys, where teams just going. We get a Veghorst or oh, we go get a Trossard. One or two signs. Just something that can like get your team across the line. You're not supposed to basically. Make a whole three plus year rebuild it's that most same. teams take in, 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 in one a window, January, yeah. Yeah. not even a summer one. A January this is a big. Window. This would be a big summer transfer window. Bro. Even for summer, it would be big. Be too big you yeah. don't agree when he said. I when he don't said think. I don't think it's a star. I think it's a star if you're a Chelsea fan and you've seen the plays, the link to whatever it is. But in terms of signings, would you say like every signing mm-hmm. is worth an a star? I I I would say I would say a strong A. Like I'm happy with a strong A. Mm. If you guys agree with A start, oh, and also thing. and also um obviously we'll talk about it later, but Jorginho looks like he might be. Yeah, yeah chill, 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 I think if Enzo gets over the line, bro, mm. undoubtedly it's an A star, bro. I think, I think undoubtedly it's already an A star. Even oh, yeah, with, with, without, with or without Enzo, I think it's an A star. Just I think also, players wise, definitely. I give you that. I think players wise, definitely. But as in, as in, like, right? Are, are we talking about right now, or are we talking about what, in, when, in the season in the future? Well, yeah, just, in just, general, just, like just, just, just yeah, the window, the window itself, Yeah, yeah, just the window. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. So like potential because Mudrik, for example, is a five star potential player. Yeah. Paulo yeah. Gusto is you know? a five-star yeah. potential Bad player. Baddy is sure you can see he just ticks every you box. Love, you love too much. Every, every signing, no, 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 every much, signing they've made, no, but every signing they've made is basically a, a future star. Bro, bro that's what I'm saying. Prospect. Chelsea yeah. are yeah. building a team for yeah. the next ten years. Yeah, bro. What they've hearing. done is effectively picked out and and seen every single under twenty-three player with like like you said, five-star potential, sniped them and said, okay, we're going to put all of these guys on eight-year contracts and just hope and pray that this develops into a super team. And yeah. the players that you're signing, bro, there's a really good chance. Because nah, then you have true. Grand Potter too. Like, mm. this is what he specializes in, finding young players and bringing them together. No, I 100%. think, bro, it's... Obviously, yeah. like, there's always... The, the, like, you have to give it time and obviously... Of course. No, like but that, here's the thing too. He's gonna leave, leave us think more. about it this way. Yeah. The next six months is very interesting for mm-hmm. Chelsea because it's almost like a preseason so before a preseason, bro. Online. It's like they're going to spend the next six months because their season's probably done, bro. They're 10 yeah. points off fourth. Maybe they could do something in Champions League, but this next six months is just going to be gelling the team to get ready for next season where, let's be real, they have to challenge for the title next year. Yeah. The amount of money that they're yeah, spending, no, 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 they will have, they to, have to challenge this immediately. this six-month yeah. period will be all about just gelling in yeah. the new players. And, and they will still make signings in the summer. They'll, get just, they'll still make extra. They'll probably spend another Because they'll million. get rid of yeah. a lot of players yeah, and, and then the funds. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. I mean? yeah, and so, Kuku's coming in. Good shout as well. And then you've got Fofana from last summer as well. The Obviously, Wesley Fofana as well. So it's like, Bro, what they're cooking right now is, is it, like you know, I completely forgot. If you're a Chelsea fan, it feels you're like you're living in dreamland right now. Bro. It's like your your dad's taking you to the shops. I say, yeah, you can get everything at Toys R Us right now. Yeah, grab whatever you want. It's this guy, you're just going around bro, the shop. Bully makes Abramovich look like a financial like advisor or something <laughs> like that. Like very responsible of his finances because this guy is going crazy. It's man. nuts how this is allowed. But I think they're looking into it, right? That's the thing. They they they're trying. They're planning to put sanctions in for. This Ma- and the next trans- transfer window to, to summer, basically yeah. max to make it five max years. Max five years because just clocking, eight year contracts, right? They're clocking. They they basically found a loophole where they're stretching out the payments across eight years to obviously get around it. But I I respect it's it. Kinda I like, respect it's kind of like if you're a Chelsea like, fan, you're gassed. I it's kind of like, like yeah. And I'm looking at you, even though he's the American. It's kind of like American sports, isn't it? Like yeah, baseball, big like contracts, like eight year contracts, yeah. stuff here's like the, that. Here's the difference, right? Baseball, okay, but you look in the NBA, for example. He has to stop calling an American, by the way. He's not American. Yeah, facts. It's a Canadian. Canadian. Is saying, that's a very worst. <laughs> <laughs> they can do that know, to you. They can do respect this. Respect me, yeah. please. He's not even American. You, you can live in New York. Yeah, I always think whenever I think well, about I live in London now. So what we yeah, say in yeah, Londoner, yeah, yeah, yeah. hey. <laughs> that's a guy right there, man. Oh, you already know. You already but know, man. The, the thing with is, right, baseball, I get it, okay? But I look at the NBA, for example. Like, players sign two, three-year deals on, like, massive amounts of money to almost protect their own future. The NBA, players sign two, three-year contracts on massive amounts of money almost to control their future. Like signing yeah. an eight year deal for me, it doesn't really make sense because you're tied down to that for life. And Chelsea fans were trying to tell me, oh, the project is so great that they want to sign for that long. But thinking about it from a professional point of view, mm. why wouldn't you rather just sign a three year contract on that kind of money? And after three years, you can decide if I like this project or stay. Eight years, bro, you're, you're stuck there, bro. Unless there's yeah. crazy clauses that like, okay, three years, then you can like buy out or something like that. Like mm. there's a buyout clause after five years, then okay. But eight year contract for it me has as to a be. Player, like, I, I, yeah, I, I feel like they, it, you're right. I think, um, 
as a, as a, if you're looking at it from a footballer's perspective, it doesn't make sense to sign an eight and a half year deal. Like what you people, people will say jo- uh, protection or whatever. Uh, if mm. you get injured, for example, yeah, yeah, you're guaranteed yeah. that amount of money, but like five years is still a lot, a yeah, lot of yeah, time. Yeah. Yeah. It is a lot. And you're right. There probably is, I would assume. There has to be clauses. There has to be clauses. Yeah. yeah. Like There's wage, no wage, wage, you, wage hikes that and all that is stuff. Like, yeah. like, like we said before, that's a death row. That's a death row contract right there, man. Yeah, that's not normal. Do you know what I mean? I've not seen that before. Are we giving them an A star then? I think it's an A star. I think it's an A star. I'm more happy with that. And there was Arsenal. That did this kind of window. Huh? You gassed, guys yeah. cannot. You let, would be gassed. We'll talk about. Oh, no, but, yeah, but, that, but that, but that, but that would be different because the direction we're we're at now. Does that make sense? Doesn't matter. Though. Like as in, like, we're rating the window. Like, no. I understand. We're rating the window. No, that's what I'm saying. That's what yeah. I said. I'm not. I'm not against it being yeah. a star. Yeah. I just feel like the amount of players. Dev- like, like say for example, the Mudrik. Yeah. Mm. If he came Arsenal, he's got time to like not ride bench, but like he can come in. Like, like now at Chelsea, he has to hit the ground running. Mm. For the price, to, even though it's an eight-year contract, yeah. it has to hit the ground running because you're not paying a hundred million. I don't even mean the pressure's there. Yeah, and the pressure's there. Not there's just a lot on of players, players on yeah, the club itself. No, no, there's like, a, like, like, yeah. like Enzo. We know he's quality. I wouldn't say world class as of yet, mm. but we know the quality. Because let's be real, yeah, we mm. all heard about Enzo Fernandez from Benfica, or whatever. But we cannot say we've watched five. Big, we can't say we all put together watch five Benfica games. Yeah, we can't. The horror, the horror we saw, we saw his quality. But in the world we saw his quality in the World Cup, but. Justify for one twenty. I think he will. I think he will flourish. Yeah, but the thing Chelsea, is, the one twenty. These kind of with. price tags, they're not by. It's, it's not for how good they are now. It's, it's for like yeah. how That's good the thing. they. He's a damn be. good midfielder like, now. I'm, but like, imagine like yeah. it terrifies me mm. thinking how much Jude Bellingham could cost. That's what I said. I said I tweeted the same thing. I, said, I dread thinking about how Did much you, he's going to go, bro. It, I'm if trying, he's, if I'm Enzo trying was one hundred twenty mil, think Jude is a bigger name commercially. He's a bigger name sporting wise. He's been doing it for longer. He's English. Yeah, bro, he will go for 170 hundred seventy million. So it's like that's what they're buying in for. But Chelsea, no, I'm happy. The, 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 like you said, the Todd Bowley and what's it, what's that guy called? Bagali, Bagali. I don't know what his name is. The other guy, the board guy. <laughs> I don't know. I don't uh, know. But um, he because I think he's be, he's the guy that's been doing the deals and whatever. But definitely the direction, the the youth that they've picked up, and mm. they're building it through youth rather Let me tell than you this, hey, bro. Chelsea have spent more in this window than all 78 Bundesliga, Serie A, La Liga, and League and clubs put together. <laughs> put together? <laughs> this is the English Super League. Forget yeah. that European Super yeah. League. We're in the English yeah. Super no, League. No, if I was right a Chelsea now, fan, I'd be so happy. Yeah, I'd like yeah, over the moon. Yeah. Like, playing curve, over bro. the moon. And like, we haven't even, we're not, obviously we're going to need to move on because we've got 19 other teams to talk about, but like mm. the Noni Madueke signing, because they signed so many players, players like Madueke, but they're under the radar. They're the ones that could even like become the best players. Let me tell you this though, spare a thought for Sterling because oh, I think Lord. six months ago, this guy was probably promised that he'd be like the, the yeah. face of the franchise. It Good looks luck. like now, bro, they've signed it's, six, it's, it's six players that are- con- mm. Mason Mount. Yeah, never mind. Sterling he, just he came and obviously he's into, yeah. No, especially he was trying to go into negotiations. And he's the face. Like, like, now he's going to be interesting. He's yeah. asking yeah. for three hundred grand. It's tough now, bro. I don't, I don't think he's a three hundred grand player. I hope he gets. No, he's, he, I hope he gets the bag. He's not in three hundred grand form at the moment. And now you're looking at the players that they just bought that kind of play in the, those positions he plays in. Mm. He's in trouble in terms of getting that kind of money. Yeah, yeah. I think I think we'll still get like uh, yeah. I hear it, but at the same time, I feel like he's a face. But three hundred grand is a bit yeah. steep for. His quality. I think that's what I'm saying. His, his it it quality, might have been yeah. a dip of form or whatever it is, but with him, it's like, it's hard. Because for me, I think Reese James is the best player at the club. He's the key player. So I think he should have realistically been the... Because I think he's he's probably the only player there that's like world-class in their position. I don't... Like Mason Mount. Uh, I'll tell you this, Mount. bro. I like Mason Mount a lot, honestly. Same. I think he's underrated. And I think he right is. now, I, I think he's been a victim of poor coaching in the past few 100%. years. He's been being played mm. in different positions. But at mm. this moment in time, bro... He is in huge danger of Dang. basically falling down the pecking order at Chelsea and becoming irrelevant. Because mm. I look at the players that they're buying, bro. He's been playing on the right, on the left, sometimes in midfield. They're signing world class players for world class amounts of money, and, and they're going to be playing, him, same bro. Hundred percent. So if they go and now. sign Enzo and Caicedo in midfield, and now you got Jao Felix and Kunku, uh, Mudrik, where, where, yeah, Maduake, where does Mason Mount fit into all that's of this? I'm looking kind of at stuff? Like, that's mm. how I've been looking at. I'm like, this guy. It's going to be interesting over at Chelsea Football Club. A lot mm. of the players, current players now, looking at all these. Players walking into uh, or the the room is good. It's always healthy. Yeah, they're, 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 but no, they're gonna be shaking their boots because yeah. they're gonna obviously yeah. have to make yeah, a lot the, of sales. The, but the, the signing the, that's the only signing I look at, and I think it doesn't make sense for me. Only because whether I feel it makes like sense or not, I think he's gonna be a very he's good an injury. Yeah, yeah he's, 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 player, he's bro. injury he's prone. Injury prone. He's not fair enough. He's got a lot of good potential. He's got good potential, but then you've got the likes of Callum Hudson Doyle on loan. You got Sterling who you brought in the summer. It's like that's that's the only sign I look at. I said he was really dumb. I don't understand that one. 
Part one, part one purely to stay as well. Yeah, listen, might be out too. Yeah, 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 yeah. But let's 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 move on. Obviously, uh, Chelsea. We're gonna give them an A star. Yeah, mm, that's yeah. A crazy yeah. window. I, I give I give it A star, man. You're never gonna, I don't think you're ever gonna get window like this, especially when Bro, they start yeah. putting sanctions in now. Because they're clocking what Chelsea did. They're not, they're not but is it a star, is it A star because of obviously the 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 magnitude of like how they spent? Yeah, 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 yeah. Or is it is it like the whole thing? It's like a player profile. A mixture of the amount of money they spent. The whole thing. How they've done it. Yeah. You guys remember how aggressive they've been? Yeah. Bear in mind, bro, Mudrik, everyone thought Mudrik was going yeah. to Arsenal. Mudrik himself thought that. They, it, that's, the only thing, I mean? that's the only thing I give praise to Bowley, like that we, can, the that we all have. Yeah. It's an owner that, he's what, he, whatever he yeah. wants, he's look. He's going to yeah. get it. Mm. Like like you said, teams might like, like Brighton, they look at Caicedo and be like, yeah, he's 8 million. Chelsea can be like, you know, F, I'll just pay the 8 million. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, yeah, I, don't, I don't want to hassle. I, I don't care about I don't the games. Hassle, man. Forget the games of like 74, 73, no. Just 80, leave me alone. Go. This, is, yeah, this is like with yeah. Le- LeBron, if you guys remember his last year at the Cavs, bro, and he was basically mm. like, they were struggling mid-season and then that January deadline day or whatever, mm. tank the entire team. Clarkson, you're in. Mm. Uh, Nance Jr., you're in. Yeah. All you guys, this is what Todd Bowley is doing, bro. He sees mm. where Chelsea's at this mm. moment. Yeah. Oi, we're just ripping it's it all apart and starting new. Potter. Like picking his strongest lineup. I don't think I'll be real. The only thing I don't think I don't think Potter's the right guy still. I don't even think that from the start. I don't think he's the right well, guy. Well, we were saying that from the start. So we, yeah. I, I, you never know. I think I think Bowley's all in with him. I think bringing he's Mourinho with his set of players coming in. Oh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> another temporary. Give me Jose into this. I'm telling you. <laughs> thing about get Jose days. in. <laughs> nah, I'm you're telling you, exactly. Man, all right, let's move on now. Let's move on. Let's move on. We've got Arsenal next. Our beloved Arsenal. Arsenal's transfer transfer window so far is. Trossard and Jakob Kiwio have come in mm-hmm. and no real outs. Obviously, we have a couple of low knees, but no real outs. Potentially um, Jorginho as well. Potentially Jorginho coming. Moises Caicedo. That's the name I want to hear Moises first. Moises Caicedo. Before we hear Jorginho. And then there's been rumours about Jorginho. So before the yeah. window closes, there might mm. we might see another player. Obviously, Declan Rice might be a summer thing. So yeah, yeah. Mm. That, that, that's not looking at January. But for January, mm. first, what do you think about the players that we have brought in? The Trossards and the Kiwio. Let's start with Trossard because we bought him and it mm. feels like because we couldn't get Mudrik, Mudrik yeah. right? So the short start signing, what do we think about that? Very good I think signing. it's a good signing. Yeah, I, it's think it's a very, I think it's a very good I signing. I think it's a very good like, signing. You could, even, you could even see when um, the Man City game, when Martinelli came on, I think that was the best 20 minute cameo he's had since coming back from the World Cup. Mm. He was beating Kyle Walker and stuff. Like, you know how, you, when you know you've got no one that's playing left wing and like that's competition, you can mm. be complacent because you're looking at it going, who can I bring on? Like the Newcastle game, we didn't make, we made no changes. I think arguably he's a, he's a better dribbler than Martinelli. No, I give he you is. that. No, I, I give you that. I give you that. Hundred percent. He creates more chances. It's not arguably, he is. No, he is. He is. He is. He's a goal Martin scorer. No, he's more of a goal threat though. Yeah, right? yeah, 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 goal indeed, threat. Yeah. But I think Trust he, he gives you a different. He gives you a different option. Yeah, I think he's a better goal scorer. I think he's a better goal scorer. I think he's. I think Martinelli's got the. I think Marty, you're right. He's he's a bigger goal threat, but he still he still needs to be nurtured to be a ruthless goal scorer. I don't think he's ruthless enough yet. Trust is not ruthless either. I think he is. He's a big game. Like he thrives in big games. He scores against yeah. the big teams. Yeah, you not like a ruthless goal scorer. To be a ruthless goal scorer, you score away from home yeah, like Goodison Park. Yeah, but then you're like also you're looking at the team. Grab the you're you're at you're at looking at the team. I know. Well. I said big game occasion. Yeah. He scored at Emirates. Yeah. He scored at White yeah. Lane last year. I think he scored two last year. But then you also look at them, the team that he's been. I think in Arsenal, when you're creating that many chances, I think his opportunity to score is going to be a lot higher. And I think you have less space at Arsenal. You get double. Yeah, that's true. You do get double teams. Respect you more. But that's also but another thing too. At Brighton, yeah. he's the guy that everyone is looking at. At Arsenal, if a guy double teams Bukayo Saka, then maybe he becomes available. I yeah. think Trossard's going to be starting for Arsenal very soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, really I think Martinelli. Yeah, I think not. Not not to say that Martinelli is isn't. I think Martinelli's potential is ridiculous, but I think it is. But he needs to use the hurry. He's, he's, he's being left behind. Saka's yeah, leaving yeah, him behind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He needs yeah. To keep and up. also, I think. Um, Sometimes you need that. You need, you know, you need health some competition, competition man. to get the, the best out of it. What did I tell you last week? Wise. Competition breeds success, bro. No, 100%, 100%. Competition breeds success. For sure. But let's let's go back to the window. Obviously, yeah. we're in Trussard. Good signing. It's not the Mudrick that we wanted. Yeah. yeah. I think that's the only thing that that's makes me go, oh, like, it's, a, it's a big thing. Because it's Mudrick. Yeah. Everyone was banking on Mudrick. And then now it's Trussard, which still arguably is a very, Maybe very, so. very good signing. Prem proven, whatever it is. But like you said, we just all. We was all looking at Mudrik. Like it's we all saw it. It's a good stop gap. Yeah, signing no, I'm happy. Opinion. He's 20. Yeah, like, like people acting like he's old. He's 28. He's 28. Yeah. Like nowadays, Just people. To, we, we nowadays see. football people are looking at it going. Even I saw a lot of people say like mm. Matoma. Like what? He's 25. I'm like, oh, what, yeah. is that? what the hell is yeah. that? Yeah. Right? I said the same <laughs> thing. He's 25. Like, yeah. He's not. Is he senior citizen now? He's done. Exactly, bro. That's how I'm looking at it. I'm like, what's going on? Bro, it's ridiculous. Here's the one. Here's one thing I'll say about Arsenal, right? Someone put out an 11 today of like the players that Edu has basically failed to get
But at some point, Arsenal are going to have to get these deals over the line. And it's not like you guys don't have the money to. You guys are offering 65, 70 million pounds for players. At some point, it's just 5, 10, get it over the line. And if Caicedo ends up going to Chelsea after you guys uh, basically were after him all window, the same mm. way Mudrik did, I'm looking at this as, as a C window no, for me, bro. Yeah, I, I, I just, I, 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 it's crazy to see. That's, that's how I'll grade yeah. it. I'll grade it as a C. Well, listen, it's... It, it's yeah. The hardest thing in, in sports in general is not getting to the top, it's staying at, at the, the top. top. Yeah, and the thing with Arsenal is they have a very young team. The players mm. that they have are all going to improve just naturally. Mm. But you look, I keep going back to Liverpool, for example. The failure to, to improve that team and continue replacing guys with, with even better players is what eventually le- uh, left them behind compared yeah. to City. <laughs> Arsenal are not that level yet. I, yeah, but I don't think it's the same, though. Yeah. I don't, the only reason why I, don't, I don't, don't agree with that part is only because it's like this is the first time Arsenal are actually at the top. And I think... I know what you mean. In terms of staying at the top in in the years to come, yeah, yeah. definitely you have to make the sign. I, yeah, yeah. I think this team that they got now, yeah, young, will, will for sure. I think we we'll, can come easily win the and I, it looks like they're gonna win the league yeah. anyway. It, I, it, I think it I find it really I mean, hard for them still, to The drop. window's still open. Uh, yeah. Time of recording. Uh, obviously, yeah. we have got Jakub Kiri Yeah, no, no, we don't know much about I him. Know I know nothing about him. I started in the World Cup. That's what I found out. I remember. He started every game for Poland World Cup. That's what I remember. Knockout rounds. Yeah. Left side, centre back, which we know of. We we heavily needed that. We needed because. Gabriel, Gabriel played one game bar, yeah, bar one, I don't know, one game. What do you guys think of the Jorginho ball? potential signing? So, should we talk about right, Jorginho now or Caicedo first? Jim. It's up to you, bro. Caicedo, I don't think it's going to happen, bro. Caicedo, quickly. Let's talk about Caicedo. Because mm. Jorginho knows a bit more of the debate. Caicedo is... He put a statement. I said, "Wants to leave." So yeah, he doesn't want to. Crazy. He doesn't want to play like that, that's that's. He doesn't see that kind of stuff. He's got bro, a new age. Talking about his I love ten, yeah, ten yeah. siblings. Bro, he's got a new management team. That's when you know he's desperate. <laughs> but when man put in an uh, Instagram post and I, tw- bro, that's when you know he's getting bro, serious. I got ten siblings. I'm the got, youngest yeah. in ten. I hear it though, bro. Yeah. I hear it. Yeah, man, so apparently he's on three and a half kill. Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. I hear it, And he can get Brighton the record transfer. He's saying, "Let me get you your record transfer." But think about it from Brighton's point of view too, and we'll talk about them obviously as well. They're in a European fight right now. They're competing for yeah. Europe, and they don't really have any pressure to sell their best players at the moment. They just lost Trossard. So for them, but it's I like, don't think, I is don't it think better for us, Kai mm-hmm. Sid? What do you say? I don't think it's that, because obviously he had a bust-up with the Zerbi. Mm. That's mm. why, no, but of that's course, why he was, was going to leave eventually. I, I personally think yeah, he would have gone somewhere. But he still wanted to keep play him. in that cup game the other day against Liverpool. I mean, the Zerbi said that we're, we'd be fine without him. But yeah. I think at the same time, like Brighton, if you give him the option I don't of believe keeping that. I, don't, I don't think he believes what he's saying. No, I don't uh, think so either. I think the thing is they're losing uh, too many yeah. players now because obviously right. Basuma left last season. Mwepu obviously had to retire. 100%. And now Caicedo is... But you're making this... We're making it sound like they don't have money. It's not about in that though. It's not about signed, that. Like you said, they signed Kukurea. They signed, they go, yeah, got they the Ben White money. I sold, 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 sorry. Yeah. They sold Kukurea. They sold the Ben Whites. I've got someone else. Uh, no, but that's the thing. They, they, so they have, they're saying they got Basuma. Basuma. Listen, Basuma yeah. But like, like they obviously, they have the money coming in from the Premier League, like, you know, the TV rights and all that stuff. So they do have money. But it's like you said, their scouting system and everything is very, it's good. very good. So they know how to find the six, seven, ten that million stars, players. What you're missing, bro, is that these teams, it's the same thing of Ajax, for example. They sell players like they have a plan basically, and that this player will be allowed to leave this window. The next window he'll be allowed to leave. The next yeah, window he'll be allowed to leave. Losing five or, or six of your best players in the same window, it same window or two, it, it, it's sense. not yeah, healthy. Yeah. Too much. The reason they were very comfortable with Chelsea because Matoma, obviously, this there was like yeah. Yeah, yeah, Matoma's been having a crazy. Even season. even so when like, like, Evan Ferguson what? just coming out of the blue and just right. yeah. turning up. But staying on Arsenal, staying Arsenal. Yeah. Let's talk about Jorginho now because the rumor that's come out most recently, which could be done at the time this video comes out. Jorginho to Arsenal. What do we think? Oh, about I want to vomit. Signing. I don't think it's a bad I genuinely want to vomit. I'm not a fan I of Jorginho. Because I feel vomit. like, <laughs> right enough, obviously told you guys, this is our price and we're not selling for less this price. Obviously, also yeah. moving like they're in some sort of Arab market <laughs> trying to negotiate and saying, <laughs> no, 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 brother, pure <laughs> handle. I give you a good price. I give you a good price. They're moving like that. Yeah. Listen. He's got six months on his that's contract. Not moving, but yeah, yeah. it's like, that... Look, if you if you want to really stay at the top, like you're like Leah said, and you want to stay at that level, you just have to be aggressive in the market. Ferguson used to do it for years. So you bro. think San Jorginho huh? is is, is going to ask? No, the top I'm level. saying get Casado, but if you're not willing to pay the price that they're asking, Jorginho's not a bad stopgap. So stars, that's 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 stars yeah. you said you want to no, vomit. Wait, wait, wait. I'm saying let's let's hear from let's summer. hear from stars. So obviously, summer. he's not happy. But as an Arsenal to fan, hold, to hold their lead, okay. to remember, you have to remember they're potentially going to be 11 points, right? Uh-huh. How many eight points with a game in hand, right? I don't know, I'm not sure. Something like that. So yeah, it's eight points with a game in with hand. With a game in yeah. hand. So if oh, you five, five. Stock on five. Oh, give sorry, five with a game in hand. So it's like, if you're only really trying to sign players right now, because you're, you're starting 11, I think it's calm. I don't think there's really much fine. change. I think there's a situation that I'm not going to speak on <laughs> that I think is, is in the, the wings. It's in the air. And, yeah, and, yeah. and, and that's, I think that is what's keeping 
Arteta on his toes. I'm scared. Yeah. Me and him are scared. Yeah, well, I, I'm scared. I hear it. But it's like, okay, Can cool. I say Ronaldo Rice in the summer? I, I, well, why not Jorginho now? In why in not Jorginho now? Chill out. Okay, Stars. Let's hear what's wrong with that. Let's hear from Stars about Jorginho. Go on, Stars. Bro, you know, a lot of people look at Jorginho when he was when he was third in Ballon d'Or. Yeah. His Fugazi, legs, his legs are done. Like yeah. his legs are gone. Yeah. He barely starts for Chelsea this year. You've seen the rotation. Injury, 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 it's he's not injured, bro. He just sits. He so just rides do, bench, bro. We don't want someone that's injured. Bro, he rides bench, bro. He's not, there's no injury. He's been injured, though. Like, I have had, no idea. He's been injury prone, yeah. bro. He's actually injured. Yeah, he's injured. He's injured. No, but I, I, don't, okay, I don't know what the situation is now it's in not, terms of his fitness, but before, the, before I'm saying, before the, the, the start of the new year, he was injured, bro. Nah, man. He was injured. He was injured, though. He wasn't injured. Bro, even, it doesn't even matter, yeah. Kim and Kante were injured, bro. No, I know Kante's been injured. But even, bro, he's he might have been injured at the start of it. Their midfield is not great, and he still can't get in. And for me, yeah, it's he he like jeopardizes the way we play because he's thank not you. he's not thank a party, you. bro. Because thank party you. party might party might not be technically as he's good. He's good. good. He's he's you know, like yeah. passing wise compared to Jorginho, because that's what he does. Yeah. But with Jorginho, he has no legs. So like, if someone like you know how with party, if someone presses him, he can do that little shim where he gets out of it. Yeah. There's no way in hell Jorginho think, think think will pass it back like he does at Chelsea. Yeah. Pass it back to Thiago Silva. He'll pass it back to Aspilicueta. He is press resistant. Jay. But the thing but for me, right? I don't know. I don't know about he, that. I don't reason why I disagree with that. It's at Chelsea. I think his options at Chelsea are... I know when you're a midfielder, I feel like you... you you're, you're, when, you're, when you're in a, like in a midfield position, you can all, your decision-making is based on what you have available to you in terms right. of the, the, the players but around they cater, you. But they cater to his Thank players. Like, yeah, Kante, that, and I agree, Conor no, Gallagher, I agree. Mark, they're pure no, no, runners, agree, bro. No, I agree with that, and I completely agree with that. But I'm saying like, if Jorginho was in his Man City side, I've got Jorginho's injury his, side. I've got Jorginho's oh, injury history Italy, now. Even when he plays for Italy, I've got Jorginho's like, injury history now. Yeah. He's not been injured since the 21 22 season. It's as simple as this. Is it? He only missed <laughs> two games. So, yeah, so what's happened to him? What's his name? He's out of favour. 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 He's out and like you said, yeah. I'll, I'll happily take Jorginho on a six-month loan. Mm. Well, that's what but I his think contract is expiring at the end of the yeah. month. So it's them ones where Chelsea are like, we're going to try to get a it's fee out of this. Bro, it's just and, penny pinching. It's and a simple exactly. Step, bro. It's and with, a and with step. Arsenal as well, yeah? What's the point? Because obviously, they're, 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 they were frightened on the Pepe deal. They knew it effed up. The 72 million that we paid wasn't, wasn't worth it. So obviously, I think mm. in the back of their minds, they're scared of the fact that they don't want to spend big money on a player, mm -hmm. which... I understand. So do you not but think, then again, you can't go. Do you not think like it's sort of like a Jorginho, the way he plays in terms of ball retention, ability to pass Very the ball, good. get out. He's get obviously, out of obviously he's he's he can't be coming no, to start though. Surely, that's Thank what I'm you. saying to you. He's not coming to start though. Lee Ben, the way Arsenal start. Start. Need he's not but that's what it is. But then I don't think he's the best. The way Arsenal, the way Arsenal play. You look at the game that they play against bro. It's intensity, a hundred miles an hour. Popping the ball at a million miles. But you don't think Jorginho can do that? Jorginho, bro, the way he plays, he slows the game down. He does it very well. Like, he controls the tempo but of the game. It, I, but everything around him is just 10 times slower. The way Arsenal want to yeah. play, bro, young, dynamic. And what look was it telling you guys comparing look it to City of 2017-18? Jorginho, for oh, me, will man. slow oh, yeah, down the way that. Arsenal oh, yeah. play. I, I, I remember, yeah, I, remember <laughs> I always remember Jorginho's performance against Spain. And it's like people had question marks about well, him. how long and he ago stepped was that? Up and that was against Pedri. That was against young, the young <laughs> dynamic. How, how, how long ago was that, bro? Do you know what I'm trying to say to you? And I he hear held, you. And he, he held it down. Really he, held it. Like, like, he can do and it. He'll it's hold not it down for Arsenal yeah. too, bro. But yeah. for me, again, I keep talking about Arsenal. I just think the way Arsenal play, first of all, like I was telling you the other week, mm. how they pop the ball so quickly, the intensity that they play at yeah. the youth, the dynamism. Jorginho, for me, is the antithesis of that, bro. Like, that is going a completely different direction. And then B, you talk about the depth and how Arsenal don't maybe have the best depth in yeah. the league. I'm a big believer that you sign first-team players so that the current starters that you have then become the depth. I'm not mm. a believer in signing B, I know what you mean. B, yeah, and B, I agree. B, I agree. Uh, B star players, and then they become your depth. Yeah, you want to yeah, keep... Yeah. That's to sustain success, yeah, yeah. bro. You have to sign the top no, players, facts. and then your your team. Okay, yeah. natural order. Yeah, yeah. no, no, I, I agree. That's that's the only thing I agree. I think in terms of like, if you want to sustain that level, you have to. But then if also moving like the way they, they're not moving aggressive enough, so that's it's why, like that's if why your option is Caicedo if, had to be the guy, or you, you yeah. already went to what sixty five million for Caicedo seventy. Yeah, yeah. Get, no, get yeah that's, done, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. Get it done. But my thing is. You, they can't. I feel like Arsenal can't also afford to not sign a midfield in this window. That's why for me, it's like if you don't get Casado, take Jorginho. Even if he's, he's not going to start, but just have him as an option because you're going to need the depth to take you to the end. Well, imagine right now somebody gets injured. 
I it's long. It. Yeah, like, I'd rather it's, get Jojo than the no one. Party, party. I'd rather get him than no one. It's long. Yeah, it's long still. You know what I mean? I'd rather get him than no yeah. one. That's what I'm saying. That's, that's my day, thing. Scared. That's my we thing. We need an extra body in there. No, I'm happy. I'm happy. Like I said, I'm happy. That's why. Exactly. Would you rather Jorginho or the Conga play the rest of no, the no, season? No, no, no. Uh, Sambi, Sambi. If you could, if you could go tomorrow, <laughs> Sambi. You might as well sign Sharky then. You might as well sign. That's what I'm If Sambi could go tomorrow, I think Sharky could do as good of a job as Lukonga. Here's the thing, though. You guys signed Jorginho. You're right job. You're not all right job. You're not signing Racing Kaiser over next. This summer, oh, if you sign be right, be right, oh. be right, you won't still. sign three midfielders in two windows. And for it me, won't happen. for me as well, like it, it goes against what Arsenal have been no, doing in terms of recruitment no, system wise. I agree. Where we've signed seventy two million, flopped, and now you're bringing a thirty one year old on a on an end of his contract. It mm. reminds you, of William two point yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, why, that's why we're greeting it. I don't want. That's why I don't want that. As a C, David Luiz, check like, William. Jorginho, learn your lesson at some point. I think David Luiz was a good servant for our club in terms of what I he have brought. All, I have all William the ones, was crap. I have all the ones he signed. David Luiz was, the sure, yeah, bro. was definitely the best servant. Change room, we helped the young yeah. boys. Like with, with, Arsenal, with Arsenal, yeah. definitely, like, they just need to ball, like, they just need to do it. Yeah. If that makes sense. Well, we never know. Deadline day, I do think we'll, be, we'll sign someone. We'll send it. We'll buy him. I've seen online, online just before we start filming, that Stan Kroenke has given the green light for Arsenal to submit one more bid. He must. You guys must sign Kaiseido. You know, for me as well, yeah, we can't, we can't keep getting away with this. And in terms of, we wanted Lissandra Martinez. Didn't happen. We had Zinchenko as our, back, our backup And man. it worked out. And yeah, it worked it out was. perfect. Mm. I, I think there was someone else. I feel like I said, Mudrik didn't work. We signed Trost. Tr- Tr- it's still a very good backup plan. Mm. Mm-hmm. You can't go from... Even Vlaho, you guys won Vlahovic, you ended up with Jesus. So you guys are getting lucky. Arteta go. is, and, is and making... This is the one where I think we'll fail. I think this one, only reason why I get it though, because... It's, if you don't get Casado now, it's rice in the summer. Do you get what I'm trying to say to you? Or it could even be both. It might be Casado and, and rice. Yeah. So it's like they they got their primary targets, and for them, it's like I would rather sign a stopgap signing who's in there. I think what they're viewing Jorginho as is a stopgap till the summer, and then potentially maybe even go back but in for Casado and league. rice. I understand. I don't know when the but next think, ta- chance we're gonna have. Like, yeah, and I agree, league. and that's why I've given it a C. That's the whole reason yeah, why I've yeah. given it a C because I feel and like you know for me, you yeah, just haven't been a Shall I be real yet? For me. I'll get if 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 it's a C if we do sign Georgina or whatever, mm. I think it would be a B in terms of no, you know how no, no shall no, I tell you right no this no 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 listen listen no listen 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 no, listen, yeah. listen 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 because it, for me you know how we talk about Todd Pollard being ruthless I think this is the first time Arsenal have had the intent to spend big money you in had January the intent we, in January last last win, uh, last year with Vlahovic oh, we signed no one. Yeah, we had known, but that's what I'm saying. But this one is like at least we've. Oh, brought so in. you're saying at least you're getting a backup? Yeah, at least at least we've got depth mm. where we need. Yeah, but that's, that's let's let's give us the position on our thing. Mean, if he's like a B minus, Edu rise, Edu must rise, bro. Bro, <laughs> bro. Nah, but yeah. you know, this, is what, like, this is how much of a difference it can no, make. I put it at C. Put if it they sign Casado, C is fair. It's an A. Yeah, fair. Of course, it's an A. Because Trossard, Trossard is still a quality signing for the depth and what you need. And then Casado is 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 an incredible signing. So Trossard, it goes from C to A. That's how much of a difference it makes. A for ambition. There you go. After Faisal, A for ambition, bro. You show the ambition, I'll give you an A. I think I think C makes sense. Yeah, the window's still open. We'll see what happens. Then that day, then that day is gonna be juicy. There'll be something going on. Let's go to Liverpool next. So they brought in they brought in one player, Cody Gakpo. He did a W for that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. one player. This, that this for me. One there. Oh, what, 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 you know, you know, you know, you know me personally. You know what? You know, you know, you know, you know, you know. I might. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what he said. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> this might be an F. I can't lie. Gold for three thousand. That's what I said. Yeah, no, if there's anything further than an F, that's I, I think it's an F because everyone and their mum oh, knew. I think F is harsh. I think it's a D. Only reason why I give it a D. Only reason why I give it a not. F because they actually needed uh, Gapo. Did they? they, they, they took him off I, don't, I don't agree. The only reason why I say that is because they got Jota was injured, Diaz was injured. They're not dead. They're gonna come back. They're bro. gonna come back. But I think Diaz is out for the rest of the season. <laughs> no, he's not. Apparently, he's out for the rest of the season. No, no, he's that's coming what, back late, but he's not out for the rest of the season. Lee's already got injury stuff wrong. Uh, apparently, that's what I heard. No, you gotta check it now. But I, I, I heard he's out for the um, yeah, basically for the bro, rest this of the season. Bro, this is an F. I'll tell you. And even if he does come late, like. Late into the season, they got ga- well. They, they took him off. They now. took him nah. under United's nose. Mm. They didn't take shit, bro. We pumped fake the hell out of them, bro. <laughs> we pumped fake it twice. We pumped fake it twice. Take that one. We said, yeah, yeah. Take Nunes. <laughs> and done it. Get up. Yeah, take nah, that Nunes. Up there. Nunes, I liked it. I liked the yeah, signing. Gakpo mm. for me, bro. A, he's not a club forward. Mm. B, the whole idea of signing Gakpo. And the reason I didn't want him is because it's yeah. all about the idea of what he could be. Oh, he could be a really good number nine because of his yeah. build and. How, how athletic he is, but bro, he can't play with his back to goal really, and he's a super unathletic winger in my opinion. Like yeah. these lanky, tall uh, 
inside forwards that can't really dribble that well and can't burn you with pace. I'm never a fan of them. Already, yeah, I have huge yeah. question marks over any attacker that you get from the Eredivisie. I've always said it. Gakpo, for me, is a complete misfit at Liverpool. I don't think he's a bad player, but for the way Liverpool want to play and how their forwards have played the last few years under Klopp... I agree. It doesn't it, suit it, it, doesn't it, suit. it makes no he doesn't sense suit them whatsoever. It doesn't suit them. It, it, it doesn't. And uh, um, obviously... What's it called? Luis Diaz is back, expected to be back in March, by the way. Yeah, March, okay. jo- and Jota and March is what, another what, ma- what, month or so. Might as well be the end of the season. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Might as well be the end of the season. Come on, like. This is why it's an F. For me, it's all. No, no, but for me. It's next I like it. But you know what it is, though? You know why I say that as well? Because, like, right now they're forcing players like Oxley Chamberlain to play out wide. I would, okay, rather, the I, would rather, I would rather have, I said to you, I'd rather spend 15 minutes get Gakpo and play him. Because yeah. especially, it's not like, the signing wasn't crazy at the time. I think it's looking I crazy. Was, I, I, it, I, it was good, I thought it was a good signing. I thought it was a good signing. I think they win the, 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 the can't be higher than the D because they yeah. clearly need the centre mid. They're not going to Before they need Gakpo. That's why they for me. They've not even bought one and the yeah, window's almost over. It's like, they clearly, the positions they actually needed, they haven't really improved. They're playing, which is obviously a good talent, but Bashisic is playing in there and I, I think yeah. they had a midfield of Harvey Elliott, Bashisic and no, uh, I like Bashisic Fabinho one Fabinho game. Right? Fabinho is cooked, yeah. bro. Yeah. He's yeah. so I, cooked. I looked at uh, Figa, I think. When just now, I remember reading upon that. His dad, I think, is a his dad, I know what you mean. Because apparently he signed yeah, a new yeah, contract right, right. and then he went out on loan. Yeah, yeah. right I'm now, not 100%. No, no, no. I remember reading that a couple days ago. No, I think the plan was to loan him. I think because of the situation, he starts in midfield for them right now. So, like, that's all they have. They've not, they've not, they, yeah, they're not so much. So, we're putting them, you don't think the gap, like, you should be different. Are you saying, look, I think he's with the player they signed, or you're saying, because I think, no, as a forward. Hold on, I think he's. A, there's a good player there. I'm yeah, not saying Gakpo is not a bad player. Not for opinion. Liverpool. I just yeah, yeah for Liverpool. I, I don't get it, bro. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't yeah. understand it whatsoever. And you yeah. basically summed up perfectly. They desperately need yeah. a midfielder, possibly more than any team on, in the league. Yeah. And to go and spend 35 million pounds on a player that you didn't really need mm. when that midfield is so bare, mm. it's a that's an F for me, bro. You know what? Yeah. For me, the reason for me, it's an I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. Actually, for me, it. for me, the reason is an F. It's not even the transfers. I, I know we're doing transfer. I think it's just top to bottom in terms of the owners are not willing I said to the spend. Same thing last week, bro. The the the, uh, the what you call it? Klopp. Klopp. I don't stubborn. know. I don't know. Stubborn. I don't know if he's. You know how like he's too with, stubborn, you bro. know like with like Eric Ten Hag or mm. what you call it Arteta. They know which player profile they want. Mm. I don't think Klopp's that person because remember, there's all you're always reading. Pep Michael Linders Edwards. is the one that yeah. really wanted Gakpo. Pep Linders is the one that wanted to lose Diaz. I remember there's, Michael Edwards was the one who was. They, bring, yeah. they had the mm. they had Michael Edwards. I think he's gone now, right? Michael Edwards, yeah. So like they don't have an idea. Like like you said, like. My, Everything hard. He's trying to build something that similar to what he had at Ajax, but obviously with much more money. Arteta, you already know what kind of players he wants, what kind of system he fits. Like they haven't looked to replace a similar build to like Mane because they tried. They tried it with Nunes. Nunes is a good player. Yeah. I think Nunes, I like through, Nunes, the, Nunes, I Nunes. Think Nunes yeah. through the middle. I think Nunes through the middle is going to work out well. But then like Gakpo, I think Gakpo was just a good player because he did yeah. well for PSV. He did well in the, in, the, for the, in the Holland in the World Cup, but type of profile yeah. does not suit yeah, them that's, that's which killed them uh, yeah. which kind of killed I mean, them I mean well, especially when, when we're looking at I agree when you're that, broke when you're broke and you, you got a, like if we're going to be real Liverpool have had misses for a while they haven't really hit so looking at it like that like you can't keep missing you yeah. got to find the pro- profile that you want it's, it's literally yeah. it. I, I agree with you like, yeah it's like you need, you need, club, you need to get what you what you what you need to what works for your stomach what works for thing if you're right now if you're Marv's and you got three pound left are you buying bacon I have of course <laughs> no, you got you, you, could, you could get a meal do. You might, yeah. You know, I threw him off. You know, I threw him off. He's expecting me to say something that's. I know. <laughs> I thought you were going to say like chicken and chips or some shit like that. You're a joker, bro. Nah, I agree with you, though. I, I said it last week, bro. <laughs> Liverpool have failed at every single level, bro. The way I threw him off was Where's crazy. Where's you say yeah, no, bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you just say it. You looked at me so shocked. Like, oh, nah, I'm joking, I'm joking. Nah. <laughs> so you got three pounds left. You can buy a chicken and chips, but you wouldn't buy bacon, yeah, would you? That's what I want. <laughs> Uh, my point was nah, joking, obviously, obviously. Nah, I know what you mean. That's not nah, what I you know, need. I know, I know, I know but what but, but like. I'm saying it doesn't yeah. work for you, yeah. Because yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. that's not what you, obviously you don't you eat that. They got desperate. Cause you know what it is? But obviously, for someone else, yeah. they could do with that bacon because yeah, 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 they eat yeah. that stuff. You weren't drinking. So it's like, yeah, it just wasn't. Uh, <laughs> but, that, but I can't even. That's my point. Yeah, that's great. I threw. I threw. I threw. The way I threw. You know what? The way I threw was crazy. You know. But look in my eyes. I said, of course. Yeah. Give me that. Look in my eyes. Look in my eyes. Uh, I'm, I'm done, but I put that yeah, in the, yeah, put that in the, just, put that in the 2023 best moments, man. That's uh, <laughs> <all right. laughs>
let's I will give let's give them a D. F. 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 I'm a D. Top to, top, top to bottom is I mean, F. Listen, hear me oh, so the, Hear me. Wait, uh, no yeah, more discussions. Boy, crazy. Boy. <laughs> what do you say? Boy, I'm a D. It's a crazy statement there. You we said I'm a D. He said I want D. I want D. Yeah. So yeah, I want to put them in D. We fast forward that. We fast forward. <laughs> I want to hear you. We fast forward. Because we don't want D. Yeah. Let me just go with that, bro. No, no, no. The only reason why I say that is because at the time, I, agree, I, agree. I thought, yo, they need a forward. I agree, I agree. Well. <laughs> I agree, I agree. I, like, at the time, I thought they needed a forward. Mm. And then they looked at the market. The only person available at the time was Gapo. We obviously pump faked them and made it seem like we were trying to go for them. So they felt pressure. Little wink in the press conference. Little like, like, that guy. <laughs> you, I, I, the only reason why I said remember, that is, they signed, they signed Gapo. Okay, you know what? December 20th. I think F is right because. F, F, no, we'll go with F anyway. Because, because of like, they, they, they literally needed a position. They didn't even yeah. even die get anyone need, that position. Die need. And I have for the rest of the season with the players in that in that yeah. position. Put Liverpool in, in F also mm. the Bashership point as well. My research team just found out the whole thing was My his dad his dad played for Celta Vigo. His dad played for Celta Vigo with Thiago's dad. Yeah. That, that's where you so got so a bit confused, maybe. Yeah. No, 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 no. It my, is. My <laughs> source, my, no, no, that's legit. You're right. That's legit. Because I've, 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 I've seen a, I've seen a, I've seen a, I've seen a picture of that as in like the dad and the, the, oh, the commentator says it every game. That's yeah. But um I read it. I can't. I didn't read. No, no. Dad, he said, I think he, I don't. Know, I think he's right. I think I read something sort of similar. I think he signed a new contract. <laughs> yeah. And I think they were planning to loan him. That's, That's what, what I, I remember reading. Yeah. I, I don't think he. They actually loan him. You check your sources, bro. It's my research team. No, nah, that is some shit. Research All right, team. let's go over to my United now. Obviously, your team. Mm. Uh, ins for my United are Jack Butland and Mark Weghorst. Out. Uh, out. 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 Big bug. Out. Um, obviously, Ooh. Ronaldo's contract yeah. got terminated, and you sent out a couple players on loan. Uh, yeah. Like show the short tires, Savage, Dubravka. Um Okay. Workhorse and Butlin. C I think it's a C. Butler's on low for Palace. Why is he yeah. low? C. C at the highest. I see, yeah, C is C. I think the highest. D. D. See me, me oh, and I got the same page there. There you go. A C as well. Uh, you know what? I with Man United, yeah. I don't know if Eric Ten Hag was back this window. No, he wasn't. From but the looks of it, here's the reality, bro. They, there's a takeover in, in, yeah. in store at the moment, and United will not be spending massive money on if players while the club. Glazers are actively exactly. looking to sell the club. So I'm. It, it pains me seeing Chelsea make all these deals and you mm. guys in for big players and like teams fighting for Caicedo and like us. You know, like, this, okay, could, this, this, could lose, this could lose you guys top four. No, I, I can't lie. I'm still confident we're getting top four. I am. It too, can lose. But it, I'm, I'm a little concerned. I can. I'm a little concerned. Because you, you guys in like the same situation that we was in last year. I think we was top four. In January last yeah, year, well, and we didn't sign no one. Obviously, we signed someone. Though. Though. It's not that like we haven't signed no one. That's the thing. Let's talk about Veghorst for a second we're, 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 because we're, 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 I, I like Veghorst. Yeah, I think, I think, Vek, like I think big strikers, we are but. better at the end of this window than we were at the start of it. Yeah, facts. In terms of who we signed, because I I think mm. what Veghorst brings to United, he's got a good singing voice as well. Yeah, he yeah, can he can sing. What he brings to United, I think he brings more of what Ten Hag is looking for in a nine than what Ronaldo was bringing for in a nine. Not to say who's better, who do you prefer. I just think that way. But the problem is. The depth is a big issue for me. And you see Ericsson now could potentially Injured, be out yeah. for a while. I heard who's the replacement? Fred. And then look who's yeah. his replacement. We're looking yeah. at Zidanek Ball or McTominay or something like yeah, that. Yeah, That's yeah, where yeah, I'm a little yeah. concerned, to be honest. Apparently, I was reading today, though. Um, they're interested in the... P- I, I don't know how true it is. But <laughs> it was, no, no. I was reading today. Apparently, they were looking at a possibility. We started seeing this. Gravin Birch on loan. I take Gravin Birch. You know, I, you know, I, you know I, guys, I, I, I need to be a public announcement. You know yeah. I feel like? I was the first person to say about Gravenberg. Did Grumbridge. you say, to United? Because remember, yeah. I said it in the chat. No, you said Gravenberg to no, Arsenal, no, no, I remember. Not to United, not to United. Yeah, to Arsenal. I'm so saying, what, no, what, no, what credit no, to what I said like, I said like, I said like, no, 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 to know, for knowing who he is, basically. No, no, no. no. That's what you're credit no, for. Listen, listen, for knowing who he is. He's not landing, he's not letting me land. Go on, go on. No, there was never one transfer, like, speculation of him being linked to anything. Uh-huh. I just threw it in there just saying, you know what? I, I did my research. I said, you know, he played yeah. 20 minutes, whatever it is. Yeah, yeah. Now I saw one, one team, one, one player, every team should sign that video. Yeah. Okay. And then obviously mm. now Liverpool's looking at, I see bad Liverpool fans twerking for him. Mm. Obviously I wanted him at Arsenal as a, as mm. a cover. Like my night's now looking at him. Yeah, they said, so the two options are, I've read today, obviously they're all rumours. They're always yeah, they get linked to every it's player a, on the planet. Gravin Birch on loan because apparently he's not happy with his minutes. Yeah, he was. 100%. Yeah. Uh, Tillerman. Um, Tillerman. 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 I got my words. You know, guys, this is that London education. Bro, what I tell y'all? That London education. That London education. Spooky, bro. Spooky. Don't agree with that. Don't agree with that. Don't agree with that. Don't agree with that. Telemans, Telemans, Telemans. That's pronunciation of names. I, I brother didn't know what plagiarism was. That's crazy. Yeah, that was insane. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, all right, guys, we're uh, talking about Elias. Yeah, crazy, Elias man. didn't know what the word plagiarism oh, meant. All right. For the silent got him at a crazy place, bro. Because <laughs> that education system is spooky. 
All right. Yeah. You know, when we're giving a John Lennon a chance, I'm giving C highest. I'm giving C highest. Do you think? In before the window, I think we'll get anyone. You know? I'll give him a D high. I, I, I don't think so. so. I don't really think we're getting anyone. I can't argue against the D, bro. There's, there's been a very severe lack of ambition at United this window. Is this the end of your, no, your then, window, bro? We, we, like you said earlier, we're, we're literally going through a takeover. Like, like people say, oh, my God, we're not spending. Of, of course, who's gonna spend a cl- bro? You don't of buy course. furniture yes. in a house that you're selling. I, I like, hear that, bro. If you're selling your house, you're gonna start buying new bro, furniture. For, for it me, don't make sense. Yeah. Nah, hold on. I, yeah, I, yeah, good one. Yeah. <laughs> I look at. There's no reason United couldn't have gotten Jal Felix. Exactly. Huh? There's no reason United. Facts. There's no reason United yeah. couldn't have gotten. Eleven, Jell 11 million though. Would you pay that low fee? It's not for what United York. needs, bro. If that, if that had beaten, uh, mm. say Jal, we signed Jal Felix, yeah. and he's the reason that we beat Palace, and then maybe against Arsenal we get a draw. That's we're ben, still in we're a complete course. different that's position, bro. Vec has got that for you. Vec no, horse is why it's we're at a that for you. horse is why we're at a C potentially D. Yeah. Jao Felix, you sign a player of yeah. that caliber. Okay, now you're looking at potentially yeah, B. Yeah, but then also you got that's why I say ambition. But I think the transfer's got to make sense. Like if you want us to cover full wages and then on top of that pay of eleven million, of course, of course, we're not narcissists. You know, we're like, we're like we're, it's a good. I love him. We're not narcissists. Like in that sense, no. I'm saying now the direction. the direction we're going in now. Anyone who doesn't understand what narcissist means means like idiots. Idiots, basically. But we're like. We're going in a direction now where you can see there's a strategy in place now. Ten Hag is saying, I want to bring players in, but I'm not going to get violated for it. Yeah. So he's obviously, they want, obviously, Yal, Yal, Yal Felix, I'm sure, an example. Yeah, was, yeah. Was, I'm sure he was the first, pro, like, he was the preferred choice. But obviously, the way they were, look, Chelsea, like I said, aggressive. They wanted it. They said, we'll just pay the money or whatever. 100%, cool. but that's why Chelsea from here. Oh, that yeah, one. Yeah. 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 yeah, but then it's like, they got, they got <laughs> it. They said we got this one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying, our oh, owners are saying, we're selling the club. Why am, I, yeah. why am I paying 11 million out of my pocket for a guy that's um, obviously not out of their pocket, but for for some that's only going to be here for six months. You don't even have an option to buy. They better hope. Yeah. All right, United let's give them their grade. And that's what I'm the saying, next bro. Team. Yeah. Let's give you that yeah. their grade. We move to the next team. I'm saying D. D. Act just I'm Vegas. C, man. They're not. They've not had the I'm same transfer as us, bro. I'm saying C. Just Vegas. We we needed a striker. We got the striker. <laughs> I agree. Now we got a striker though. We got we got someone. We need we needed options which we were lacking. We got the options. That's the got, bare minimum, bro. If we give also it's about what striker you got as part of it as well. Yeah, but he's bro, from what bro, from what we've seen of him, he's he's been good for us. He's been alright. He's a good player. He's been good for us. Like cool. He's been, he's been good. Like, no, would you be happy if he's there? Would you be happy there if he's there next season? What? Would you be happy? So then, so that's the deal. But that's the whole point, though. But that's the whole, no, but you, you're rating it in terms of, I'm talking about like what we need. Give him a deal. Yeah. Yeah. No, I was on a C. No, you can be no, 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 but you're saying the whole, the, it's, a, it's a six month loan. There is no option to buy. So we know that he's only here for six months. Of course. But that's so why I'm saying, I'm judging it on that. Like we need a striker. He's a C now. minus. This he gives is a C us a different option. Yeah, it's still a C, though. Can you put it? It's still a C. Put it in the middle. Why is it a D? Because you only got white workhorse. But who, who, what else did we need? Like right now, you need just a, a cover just in case of what do you call it, Casemiro. If he goes out, you don't yeah. want to be playing McTominay there. Okay, but the sign is okay. <laughs> hold on, hear what he's saying. You, you got to be realistic though. It's January transfer window. I'll, I'll, I'll t- I'm, I'm saying, saying go out. That's why four million player. No, because I'm saying no, but you know why I say that? Because I'm saying look, that like every team's circumstances are different. Yeah, Chelsea got a new owner that's ambitious. He he's gonna be. You know, in, he's, in, he's in, shown in, in his talk, aggressiveness. He was talking yeah? about school systems. Yeah, now. you know, a C is a pass. C is a pass. Did you pass? By pass. just by Wiggles, you passed the transfer. Pass me personally, needed, it's not a pass. But it was, I, I'm okay, Leah, sit up. Beginning pass. In the window. You got what was it that we needed? Three to one. What was it that we needed? We needed a forward, right? We needed a forward. Did yeah. we get the forward? We got a no, no, borderline no, 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 C no, forward. No, no, no. But I'm saying, I'm saying, for for the for the resources that we had available to us, did we get a decent forward? Remember, Ronaldo. Mind term, the we had Ronaldo available. Mind just the United. Yeah, you have every bro. resource. You had Ronaldo well. terminate oh, his contract, so that's a lot of money going back in. Thing, bro. bro, we took Ronaldo's five hundred thousand pound a week contract off the books and replaced it with Velvet. No, I, I hear I it. Happy I hear it. I hear it. More. I, I would. I would give it a D if, the, if, if if the club wasn't being sold. Okay, no, that, no, okay, no, look at if we didn't sign Veghorst, for example, it would be an F. Yes, yes. So we signed Veghorst. That would just jump to a C. Because for me to do no, how much you guys right, I don't know. Put it in you, got, you guys got to look at you got, hard. Hard. No, 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 you got to look at as well yeah. you yeah. got to look at as well you're playing four different countries yeah. I think you're playing every three and a half days from yeah. now to the like end of Feb we're the only team in England still in all four and you're telling me and you're telling me you've got the depth to go into a seat like if I'm Ten Hag I'm like guys like I'm desperate I need a midfielder on loan hopefully get it tomorrow I'm not disagreeing with that I'm saying bro our circumstances the club is being sold like the owners are selling the club that comes into effect so it's like how do you but they still own the yeah. yeah, they still own the club, so they can they can still support. Like like say like you said with Liverpool, they're not going to bro. Huh? They're not going to if the, tar- the, the for the targets that, that Ten Hag wants, then they're not going to spend the money. But that's that also why it's a D. That's also why it's a D, bro. You have to take that into effect. They didn't back I'm the manager. Into effect because he's, he's got us. He's got a It's a D. Let
Breakfast can is we, doing all right. Like, I don't see what the issue is. I move, understand we need more depth. Can we move to the like, blue side of Manchester? Can. Yeah, we yeah, can. Let's yeah, do, blue let's moon go. rising. Let's get did, they, did, they, yeah. did they get anyone? They got the Ma- Maximo Argent- Perone. Yeah, Argentinian, got it. And they yeah. have now just loaned out Jao Cancelo. Hey, Elias, Joao man. Cancelo. Hey, man. Yeah. That's what's not to like, bro? Pour up the Henny, man. Pour up the Henny. Hey, man. What's not to like, bro? You got me. <laughs> <laughs> Look, man, I don't think Jao Cancelo has played a single good game since I made that video. In I fact, I think the, the, the following game after that video was against Liverpool. Oh, yes. And he, he got tried touched. controlling and got touched by Salah. Yeah, I yeah, cursed yeah. this guy, bro. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. when the announcement got uh, made, he went on to Bayern Munich. What's your, what was your notifications like? Bro, it's crazy. <laughs> I'm yeah. telling you, when that error happened against Liverpool, I think I got more notifications than him. <laughs> Today, I think the same thing, bro. Honestly. I think man. you got a message of saying, hey, man. You guys are tired. Hey, you, guys, you guys are tired together now. Bro, facts. You guys are tired. I got to go watch my Bayern now. <laughs> you might as well get Wait, Bayern bro. fans, yo, he wears the number seven. He can play on the left back and right back. You got the Travella on lock. Yo. What's up the leg, yeah, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just cursed him now. You just cursed well, him. I reversed the curse. So now for hey, Bayern, y'all got, y'all, got a, y'all got a good one right there, bro. But, bro, and Celo, man. It's crazy. I think. We were talking about it a little about yeah. the how ruthless Pep is, and you said I don't think a lot of players like Pep as as a personality. For example, mm. I don't know too much about him as a personality, mm. but he's a bastard. Excuse my language, bro. A bit is, like is, a bit is. like Fergie was as tell. well. Yeah, yeah, bro, yeah. these guys are ruthless winners, and I keep going back to Liverpool in, in terms of sustaining at the top. You can't take shit from anyone. If you believe the reports about Cancelo, he was very unhappy with his playing time. Yeah. He wanted to be playing every single game. He almost got into a, basically a fight with Pep Guardiola and senior players had to split them apart. Oh, wow. That shit cannot fly at a top club, bro. Mm. That it's shit Pep cannot, though, isn't it? Hundred percent. But but Pep mm. Pep dropped him not because he's a bad player, but because he clearly thought that his level was dropping. At this point yeah. in the season, they're competing for a league. Hundred percent, and yeah. and they're falling away from that league title. So you you basically have to make uncomfortable no, uh, decisions. Pep's too. Mm. Pep's also like too prideful because yeah. you know them ones are like I'm looking at Rico Lewis. He's turned out to be a success at right back mm. in there. But play like you can play Nathan Ake at left left centre back and then have him play in his normal position at left back. But he said. I don't even want you to touch the pitch. I want. Yeah. I, I'm a put. I can't left yeah, back. That's what I'm saying. Rico yeah. loser right back. Yeah. And saying that, 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 I cri- that, that I criticize Pep for because that's what I'm saying. You, you, you was talking before about the Guardi- um, the Guardiola Ferguson comparison. I think Ferguson would still try his best to put out the best team possible. Yes, fair enough. He didn't take bullshit, but True. he would still try. But his best I life. believe that yeah. Pep. I honestly think Pep truly believes that his best eleven is the one he's playing at the moment, bro. I truly believe that. Yeah. Those, these past few weeks, he did not see Cancelo in his best eleven. Mm, I agree. I think it's more of a statement. I agree. Yeah. More, more I think it's behind more than you believe. More than I, think believe. I, I, I agree. I think, it's more, right. I think it's more than that. I think he does think, oh, you know, I agree right now that maybe the 11th, okay, maybe that there is some truth to that. Okay. That, that, that I'll probably say, yeah. But I also do believe he does things to make statements. 100%. To make it, it's to make, it's, 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 he's making a statement. But the, that, statement, you know I mean? the statement that he made by dropping yeah. Cancelo, by dropping Bernardo, yeah. is that no player has a God-given right to start in my football team. Mm. The, uh, Pep Guardiola's football, Past Tiki Taka is about desire. It's about intensity. Mm-hmm. These attitude, players right, are not attitude an attitude, well, yeah. bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If these players aren't playing at that level yeah. consistently and hungry, he had that interview of Rio where he said the same exact yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, Eventually, yeah. players reach the top and they just get complacent. It's like you have to yeah. shake. But bro, yeah, he said the exact that's same thing. thing. And yeah. Pep has an yeah, amazing job in the past of doing it. Fergie, I always bring it back. Thought, He's yeah. the best ever at doing, doing that. that. Yeah. Stay at the top. You got to make uncomfortable decisions. That's the difference between Pep and Klopp. That was, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Pep rides out for his guys. Exact point I was gonna make. Yeah, he's got nothing left. Look, yeah, look. Klopp's mm. held on to somebody's place for a bit too long. Look, it happens, yeah, and that's yeah. why I pep the serial winner. Fair enough, bro. Cancelo, you were a good dude, bro. You were a good dude. <laughs> yeah, you had some yeah, good bro. memories, but welcome to the university. I don't know, man. I think it's a it's a big move from Guardiola, especially at this time of the yeah, year yeah. with with the way the league's that's going. That's great for us. I got shake yeah, hand, man. What do you shake my hand for? You're the reason we might win the league now. Can you, can you come back? I was going to say, if I really have this power, yo, Haaland, bro. Can you, yeah, yeah. Can you come back Haaland for us? Haaland, bro. What's not to lie, bro? Yeah, honestly, <laughs> big center <laughs> forward, <laughs> holds the line well, unbelievable finisher. Where's the number nine? Bro, what's the line? Yes! We won the league! Yes! We won the league! I heard, though, that they're going to try and... Yeah. I, I heard a rumor, I don't know how mm. legitimate this is, that they might sign Anthony Robertson uh, from Fulham. Oh. Oh, what is yeah. it? oh they were linked to him before. I think yeah. they tried to sign him before still. I think when they got relegated the first... First time, I think. Yeah. Tried to I don't know if he's at the Rockets. I don't know if he's at the if he can play his yeah. football. Yeah. I like him. They gotta yeah. go for Kyle Walker Peters, apparently, man. Hey, hey man. man. Hey, hey, man. man. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> I, you guys laughed at me when I said <laughs> that one. Uh, okay, what are we putting City Chance window? Because they only yeah. bought Peroni and they lost um, Cancelo. Is, 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 is that like a void? Like, they, they, they shouldn't even be ranked. No, I think they're enough. I can't. That's enough. Yeah, it's enough. But also, 
We got bear in mind, do they need a lot of signings? No, but now imagine. I feel like they do, you know. I feel like I don't know why. I feel, I feel like, like wingers. Why? I feel wingers. like yeah. they I still haven't really, wingers. really replaced the, the, the guys that left in the summer. You know what? Yeah. I, I want to change it. Yeah. Hear me out. I think it should be a D because I think getting rid of Cancelo huh? was actually important. Nah, that's no, hold on. Let me. Let me you, you dare put my seat next to my United. Let, let me finish. Up. They, they needed. Bro, they couldn't. They couldn't. They couldn't have Cancelo, bro, being that negative of a of. There, there's been rumors the last few weeks that he's been on yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, been yeah, yeah. You can't have players like that rotting up. Bernardo's been out for a couple yeah. of years, though, isn't it? Yeah, so for me, I could hear a D, to be honest with you, bro. No, because if that's, if, that's, if that's a D, as in, like, for Cancelo leaving, then you that's guys deserve an A for Ronaldo. If this helps them win true, the league. True, if this true, helps, true. Yeah, yeah. So true. And they didn't get a Cancelo free. So keep yeah. I like that point. Yeah, 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 I was just about to move up to D. I was just about to move up to D, but your point kept me. I agree then, F. Now, F, F is fair. I All right, I'll put him in F. F is fair. Yeah. Should F we go? Yeah. <laughs> fail, fazel, fail. All right, yeah, we're, we're gonna, everything, we're, everything, we're, everything, we're gonna, speed past a few dudes because obviously not every team has signed up players. We got Spurs next. No one out. That and Juma in. If Pedro Poro is also coming. Pedro Poro looks like it could be in, but yeah, no, it looks done. like it's done. Yeah, it's coming. It's, it's coming. It's done. That's good signing. Over the line. It's good. That's very good signing. Imagine when City hijacked it. Daniel Levy is obviously the old player. Daniel Levy is obviously known to be a tough, like you know. Tough negotiator, tough guy. Mm. They've got the Juma loan. Pedro Porro, finally, they can look at Emerson right out and be like, hey, keep Jed the dust. Jed Spence is going to run, I think. Jed I Spence? I think he's going to run. Yeah, he's going to run, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So what are we thinking that we'll put in Spurs? I think B, to be honest yeah, with you. Yeah, B's not fair. Who do they sign? Dan yeah, Juma and, and then Pedro Porro. Pedro Porro. Yeah. Pedro Porro. I think that's a, that's a yeah, B, to be honest with you. I still think yeah, I like they needed I like a creative that, midfielder for me, which mm-hmm. would have probably taken them to A, potentially A star, but I think good signings. Brian Gill went back to Sevilla. No, I'm happy with B because. What you call it? Conte got what he wanted, a right wing back that yeah. can yeah. play his system. Mm. I said the other week, right? Like Casemiro to McTominay for me is the biggest deficit between player like replacement. Pedro Porro to Emerson for me, mm. from what I've seen of Pedro Porro is a huge so, so I'll tell you what else was huge. Kieran Turney, from Zajeka to Kieran Turney. Oh. Right. That, mm. that, that was huge. I remember mm. there was one passage to play where he suddenly uh, cut in, tried to do no look pass with his right foot mm. inside. He fizzed it out of the play. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I like, said, no. Lord, have mm. just stop that. <laughs> Stick to that byline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need <laughs> to run up and down. The was like, you and I, we're not the same, yeah, man. We're not the same. We're built different. All right, Spurs, open them. B? B, yeah, yeah I'm happy I'll say B. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I mean, potentially even a centre back they think they might need as well yeah. but, no, but you know with them lots they, the they don't like to shaky. spend much money yeah. anyway so. yeah. Conte's moaning paid off okay so we've done the top 6 we're going to add Newcastle because now they're they're, 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 they're they're almost they're there. ahead of Man United yeah. so they're, saying, yeah, yeah, they're in that category and they've got a lot of money so they're going to be Is always they're not third what in the table, table. Yeah, yeah, yeah they are yeah, yeah, but the game in handle but yeah, I, know, I, know, you, I know I know with now the the Saudi Arabia money they're getting the Arab money so Hey, shout yeah, out Buster, man. Yeah, so that's so that, so that, that, <laughs> trying to get like you, my we boy. Need to, we need to talk about them in in, in this in this video. Yeah. Um, if you guys want to do, talk about all the other teams as well, we might do an extension of this after the windows officially closed. We'll do a quick, quicker version of all the other teams. But we're going to end it on Newcastle. Mm. Uh, Newcastle's main in was Anthony Gordon. AG10. 40 million. AG10. But he's not uh, AG10 no more, right? I don't the, know. The, yeah, AS, uh, well, Alex Maxwell, Maxim, I was singing. Yeah, ASM is ten, right? Yeah, I have to give another one. I think they, they're they're low key. I think after Gallagher, because I think Everton made that bid for Gallagher, oh, but he wants to go to a, a big six club. I don't think he's I, that saw good Ma- I saw Madison linked. <laughs> yeah, Madison was linked. Yeah. Yeah. Ma- Ma- Madison, Madison been wanting to go to Newcastle. I don't, yeah. I don't blame him. I don't know about Gordon to be honest with you. Like, I've been, yeah, I like I'm I said, not a big fan of him. I told like. you a few episodes ago. I really like what Newcastle are doing. Like they identify young talent, they get mm. them. Anthony Gordon, though, I didn't like the sixty million pound move to Chelsea. I didn't get it. And I don't know if that's the kind of player Newcastle need at this moment. Maybe well, I'll, maybe forty million yeah. as well. Cost. I feel like he's he's a good he's a good talent. Mm. Clearly, I don't think he's worth forty. But million. is is he like top end talent? That in a few years, like when they're trying to compete for, like when they're in the Champions League, mm. is he going to be one of those yeah. guys? I don't see it personally. I agree with you as well. Yeah. That's the thing. If your ambition is Champions League football and trying to challenge for the Premier League and yeah. Champions League, Aaron Gordon for the I amount of money Newcastle I mean, maybe, can spend, yeah, I don't, I I don't think, think I don't better, think Aaron Gordon work for them because he's in the NBA, but. Aaron uh, Gordon. Anthony, Anthony Gordon. Gordon. Anthony Gordon. Oh. Did I say Aaron or did he say Aaron? Did you both say it? Did you tell me both said Aaron? I swear I just said Gordon. No, no. Also, no, 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 week is coming up. He might enter the dog contest. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> he, might, he might drop a new song or something. Yeah, I don't know. I can't see it. I, yeah, I, I don't know about him, to yeah. be honest with you. We'll see how it works. But yeah. already you saw. But here's the thing, too. He's hardworking. He's industrious. And I think that's, Eddie Howe. And I think that's what Eddie Howe. I was going to say, Sam Maxime, you've seen. He's basically out of the picture at Newcastle. He's like a. You think so? He's an impact sub, bro. Because the way Eddie Howe's team. Is based playing. on it's mm. it's structure, it's organized. A guy basically doing flip
Anthony Gordon. Anthony. Anthony. There you go. Anthony. 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 Not Anthony. Yeah. That's Anthony Simmons. Not the real Anthony. 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 <laughs> Anthony. Yeah. Anthony. So, I don't know. Forty million. Yeah, I think. So, I think. No, you know what? For the price, for his age potential, I see. I see it. Mm. But if that's if that's like I get. I'm, I'm mm. on your page in terms of like Champions League football. Yeah, long term. Long like, term. Yeah. Why? Mm, maybe I think right now he, he could, he could be the kind yeah, of player yeah. that gets them over the line to make top four this yeah. year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But long term, with yeah. the amount of money that they have and where they want to be. I think they yeah. can do better, to be honest. When they yeah. also uh, loaned out Chris Wood to Nottingham Forest, which is, <laughs> I think he should have gone Everton. His job is done, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, you know. If if they'd waited a few more days, and when Sean Dyche came in, mm. Chris Wood to Everton would have kept them up. Mm. Even better romantic story. Would have kept them up. <laughs> Sean yeah. Dyche, Chris Wood, they need that you know, striker yeah. like that. Like Chris Wood, bro, the work is done. It always will be. The, the goal is just to relegate Burnley. He did his work. You can go. You can go in peace now, bro. <laughs> yeah. How? What do we think of their window then? Uh, I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not. It's not uh, special. C. C. Mm. C really? Yeah. C. They, they got, they got a player that'll improve. They got right Australian Garan yeah, Garan yeah, Cole. Fast, yeah. fast, fast. I say C. Yeah, C. Yeah, okay. Say C is fast. Too, yeah. C? Because for me, yeah, yeah, I'll be real. Yeah, like looking like if you're looking at B A A plus, it's players that will impact and get them. Through the like cross the cross the line kind of thing, mm. whereas I don't see Newcastle at the moment because I think they're looking at that guy as well from Flamengo. I don't know his name's like Frank or something like that. Mm. But with Frank. Anthony Franca, Franca, I don't know. Oh, Frank. Frank. Yeah. Frank. I, say, I would be surprised if it's called yeah, Frank. Like a Brazilian guy called Frank. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Joe, Joe yeah, 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 go, go. <laughs> Joe, yeah, go, Frank. Yeah, but yeah. looking at him, like yeah, like I said, AG ten, like I think it's just a good signing. Yeah, please stop that, man. AG ten. That that's, that's, what, that's what he, he always, started calling first. No, but you keep saying AG10. Why, why, are you, why are you, why are you huh? saying it? You keep saying it though. Because yeah, it sounds better. It. it sounds better. AG10. Nah, nah, stop it, saying it. Nah, man. Nah, stop nah, doing it. It, nah. it sounds better. Nah, that ain't it. Nah, that ain't it. What's his Instagram? His Instagram AG10. Yeah, AG10. It's gonna be AG16 or something like that. Yeah, he's gonna change his number. Yeah, he can't get 10 now. All right, so that's how our top seven. Big grading is looking. A big seven. Yeah, that's the craziest thing. Literally, the team that was it, the team that's the lowest is at the top. Yeah, man, they they obviously have big attention. They can only go one and way. And then bro. Man City is at the oh yeah, man. It's, like it's it's what you need to what you do. But uh, let us know what you think. Uh, also, if you spot any other teams that we haven't covered, let us know in the comments as well what you think of those ones and where you think they would rank amongst these teams in in this grading system. Uh, and then we'll see you guys in a few days. Peace. <laughs>